I mean, Wick, I know you got something to say. Don't be staring through the man's head. <laughs> oh, no, I'm just, I just got some damn squinting. I'm like, wait a minute, you got to go. What the fuck problem? Still saying Is it a problem here? You, you, you got a problem you, you with remember, you? You remember back in the day when uh, oh, your parents used to say, don't make me jab, slap you. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And I don't want you to die in front of the Jew. But now, look, look, no. I did want to ask you a few questions about... Okay, you know the situation with takeoff and and mm-hmm. a lot of the uh, so, you know yeah. the rappers that have passed. Yeah. Since it's kind of your generation a little bit, mm-hmm. I want you to give us some insight on what prevented you from mm-hmm. going down that same path. That's one one of the questions. Okay, and why do you think that so many other rappers from y'all generation and now are passing or dying at, from violence? Mm-hmm. What is it? Is it has the is it the the gangs have infiltrated rap? True, cause if if you look at it back when y'all were doing it, games was around then, but y'all didn't exploit it like that. Y'all exploited more of the hardcore shit, you know what I'm saying? Of rapping style, like y'all wasn't on every record saying, "Got them Sue Wu, got them and ride by y'all spray the motherfucker." Up. Mm. Yeah, and 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 uh, 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 I think that from our generation too, our uh, venom was spit more towards the police. The establishment, mm, the government. Mm, true. You see what I'm saying? We yeah, kicked okay. the same type of stuff, mm, but the violence was directed toward the black cats, mm, the red dogs. Mm, At some mm, point, it kind of right. it, it went, it transferred to y'all to each other. True. W- why do you think that is? Why do know, black it, rappers it, hate each other so much? It's hard to say. You know, I had got shot eight times, but yeah. I, I I walked away from mine. You know what I'm saying? I got hit up eight times back in '08, but it be. I want to say certain situations of the artist because, like, you'll forget you the rapper, you the you the rapper, like, so you gonna be noticeable out of Damn. anybody, like, say me, me wicked, be high on the corner, but they round straight, straight dead time, straight yeah. from the dead time. Wicked, you can't go sit at the Tesco for eight hours, ten hours, and still hang with the boys, smoke weed, and. Think you can sell a few dimes or whatnot because mm. of the fact the nigga at the red light gonna notice. Go but that it. wicked, yeah, right. But that nigga got some rap money in the pocket, not knowing. What the right. hell? I look like bringing some my rap money. Oh, you think I'm gonna be at the Tesco? I'm already at the Tesco. Right. I'm already at the gas station hanging out with folks. Mm-hmm. You think I'm be sitting up here with a quarter million dollars in my pocket? Right, yeah. right. Come on, but right. a nigga attention span he ain't looking at it like that. But in here, you the rapper, you got some. But I can get a chain. I can get a watch. Oh, but he might got some racks in his pocket. But at the same time, he don't emulate his cell like he want a pistol and then he pulled a five. Now it's a life or death situation. You pull your five and kill him, or he pull his five and you in the midst of you reaching for your five, he kill you. Right. And that's a rapper gone. Right. Because it really don't switch from, I mean, street niggas still dying. Niggas die every day. Right, right. But it's, it's the rappers who died before the street niggas now. Back mm. a few years ago, it was the street niggas, and then the rappers rap about it. Exactly. The rapper about my home buddy died. Now yeah. it's the rappers dying, and street niggas can't rap because they street niggas. Yeah. Wow. You just unlocked the code and told the whole thing right wow. there because that's exactly what I've been saying my damn. So I said, it's getting to the point to where. The artists are dying more so than the folks that's dying in the doggone street. Yeah, and then right. it'd be like bad. The artists would be put in a bad situation. Like, I just be a Kentucky gun charge. Yeah. These folk tell me, I, my, the gun charge, it went my gun. They charge me possession of a firearm by a convicted feeling, but it's my security guard if I own. Mm. Security guard showing these folk gun license, Georgia gun license for their gun. They telling me, by you being a convicted felon, you know you're not supposed to be around a bullet. But I'm telling them I'm not a regular civilian, I'm an entertainer. So if I'm going out of town to pick up money, I gotta have armed security because of the fact the people in that town who might be on miscellaneous bullshit, no one I'm coming to their town to pick up some money. Come on. So they could be waiting at the venue, in the alley of the venue, the back of the venue, and when I come out, cause you telling me I'm convicted, I can't have a fight on, they robbed me for my my show money because this is my job, I do shows. Yep. They robbed me for my show money cause they know I'm coming to that town to pick up for some money. money. And now that I don't have a fight on, I get killed. Mm. And the killer get away. Because nobody know him. He just, he's just a regular street nigga thought a he was going to come up. Killer, yeah. Man. So I had to present to the judge like, bro, rappers are dying. And I don't want to be specific on what artist name I brought up to yeah. the judge. Like, hey, man, these folk just got killed with their kid. Exactly. 
It's not like I got the gun on me. Like, nah, I ain't. I understand I'm a convicted felon, but you can't tell me I can't hire armed security. You telling me I can only hire uh, unarmed security. But what the hell up? Uh, unarmed security you gonna do, do besides and, run? And when we in a nigga city and they fire deep and they up fucking two two threes on me, they sending right. missiles. You trying to karate chop some oh, damn come body? On, man. <laughs> come on, come on, man. Come on, you good night. A, you in a lose lose situation? Well, come on. But and, and it's hard to say like okay some some artists do have the gift of gab of not having to do a show you know what yeah. I'm saying I do show because of the fact these folk be want to see me they really love me yeah. but I can't tell you if it's gonna go bad in your city I play it cool I try not to cause some nigga be on the macho man random savage shit when they go to these folk city nah I'm not doing all that I'm coming in town and and, and the way I got my shit set I'm down there coming in town I hour before the show. Pulling straight up to the club, do my thing, and then I'm out of there. That's right. I ain't trying to kick it. I don't want to come to your neighborhood. Y'all can have y'all city. Come on. If you say you running, run that motherfucker. Right. You feel me? Run that motherfucker. How you running, cuz? I'm in and out. 